Iran's Mir News Agency says President Ibrahim Raisi and the country's foreign minister have been killed in a helicopter crash. These are the images rocking the Middle East this morning. The charred remains of a helicopter, its tail partially intact. News that rescuers who took hours to reach the remote site found only wreckage and the bodies of the dead. Iran's hardline president and its foreign minister brought down by bad weather, an official said. This morning, countries close to Iran sending sympathy, including China, Russia and others in the Middle East. Good morning, America and the rest of the world. Xander J. Hobson here, comedian, director and producer of boxing documentaries and troll to those who need trolling. This here is another episode of Hell for Love News brought to you by the Brilliant Artist Movement. Folks, do me a favor, subscribe, like this video, share it, and by all means, leave a comment in the comment section because I enjoy checking out the feedback from these videos that I make as well as exchanging opinions and points of views with you all. Ibrahim Raisi ran a government that launched missiles and drones at Israel just last month and in 2022 brutally crushed protests over the death of a young woman, Masa Armini. This morning, leaders of Hamas adding their public prayers. So anyway, Iran and its allies are mourning the untimely passing of President Ibrahim Raisi. President Raisi and members of his staff met their untimely demise in a helicopter crash in bad weather. In the US, the Senate Majority Leader racing to signal an assessment that this was not part of a plot against Iran's leaders. I've just spoken to the intelligence authorities. At this point, there is no evidence of foul play. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, if I haven't learned anything else in all my years of living, I learned that if it ain't one thing, it's another. So with that said, ladies and gentlemen, I'm done with it. 